What's up, pussies? I'm Heavy Metal Dick, and this is Heavy Metal Homesteading. We are here today, uh, we're going to assemble our bike rack, and then we're going to give it a test fit, and then hopefully at some point I will get a uh, hold of a welder again, and we'll, uh, we'll blast some heat at this and get it fully finished. But we'll give it a little test fit into the truck, make sure it works. Um, so I'm going to show you guys how this whole fucking thing goes together, and the brilliance of this system. Let's make it happen. Alright, so this is more or less how it's going to work together. Um, so the bikes will roll into here, front tire, and then this whole piece will fold up and then hold the front tire in place. So I've got a two foot length of uh, piano hinge here. And we're just going to line this up by laser highball uh, in the center. And then we're just going to drill a couple or three holes. And rivet this in place. Okay, so that's the first course all riveted together. Now this going to be quite a bit more interesting doing this side. Okay, so I've got this lined up uh, offset by uh, exactly one width of this because when this longer wider piece folds down uh, it needs to sit flat in the bed of the truck there. So now we're just going to go ahead and rivet this hinge on to here making sure that we are lined up as best we can be left and right to make sure that the bikes will fit in snugly. However, some shit has happened with uh, heat movement and whatnot, and things aren't super lined up, but let's hope it works anyways. <laughs> I done fucked it up. So I don't know if you guys can see, but deep down in there is the the tail end of the rivet. And I can't get it to come back out again. So I thought maybe I'd just shove it out the top. Oh, Jesus. You gotta put the tip back in, dumbass. Okay. I think we are more or less back in business now. Haha. <laughs> Got all the parts out. Okay, so now... That will fold like that. Yeah, it's good, yeah? Yeah, like that. Alright, so now we can see it in all its glory. So the bikes will roll in here. This will fold up. But how far do you think we're going to hold the bikes in there? That's the next piece of brilliance that's come out of my brain. Storm door chain. got a spring in the thing in the middle of the chain, or on one end of the chain, I guess. Okay, so we're just going to go ahead and take this silly fucking bracket off the fucking thing here. Actually, come to think of it, we could actually use that. I'm going to use that. I'm just going to rivet that on right through that fucking silly bracket. Yeah, let's do that. See how that's springing the things? So we'll be able to pull that in, pull that as tight as we can, wrap it around, Clip it on with a one of these guys. Brand spankity new. Picked him up this morning. There we are. So now, put the bikes in. We lift this up. And we'll just wrap that around. Clip it onto the chain, wherever it needs to be. To hold the tension properly. And we're laughing. Uh, 
Uh, that being said, ideally what I want to do is weld this bracket on. And then on this end, I want to cut... And I'm going to get some heavier duty chain than this. This is just what came with the storm door fucking spring of a thing. So when I get the welder back, I'm going to weld probably a half a chain link on here and take this goofy bracket off and put it right through that. And then I'm going to weld another piece of plate steel with a notch cut into it so I can just push this up and then pull the chain through and just link it in. But for now, this will work beautifully. Um, just to just to get us by until, like I say, until I get uh, a hold of a welder again, or maybe you guys will think this is such a great video that you'll get on my Patreon page and you'll buy plants to build one of these. And enough of you will do that that I can afford to pick up my own welder and get this finished up nice and good. However. In the interim, let's put a second one of these storm door chain thingamajigs on. Hey! Oh, I heard again, you fuck. Is this enough camera angle for you? Does this make you happy? I think this is like the fourth different angle. No shade outside. I'm sure you'll have some other critical to say in the comments of this video too, which I do appreciate, but you're still a fuck. You motherfucker. Well, what the fuck? The other one went on, just barely, but it went on. Sometimes you just gotta spread them out with a little bit of force. <laughs> winner, winner, chicken dinner. Now let's do another camera angle. Another camera angle. And let's put a bike in this and see how it works. Now keep in mind, when I'm actually using this, it will be bolted into our truck somehow. Alright, as it would appear, the chain is a little tiny bit short. But, uh... Ow! Monkey fucker! That hurt like shit. That's solid steel. It'll just come down on my foot. And as you can see, I am wearing my safety approved skate shoes in the shop today. Because safety is always number three. Alright, let's drive a quick link in here. See if that gives us the extension that we require. What for to wrap the chain around the thing make it fucking work. And just for shits and giggles, let's try a different spot in the rack. And there we have it. Bike in a bike rack. That shit is going fucking nowhere. Alright, so there we have it. There's the bike rack in the back of the truck. Uh, we've got it just bungee corded across the middle to uh, our in-bed retention system. I'm going to build something better uh, when I eventually get a welder again. Uh, let's put this in here so you can see how it all works. have it. So it holds itself in there quite well. We took it for a trip uh, out to one of the Gulf Islands for a week. Uh, did some shuttle riding and it holds the bikes in their beauty. Um, so yeah, there she be. So if you enjoyed the process of watching this, feel free to give our video a like. Uh, if you want the plans for this, the plans will be up on my Patreon page shortly. Feel free to subscribe to the channel. Check out some more shit that we're doing around here. I'm the heavy metal dick. Fuck you. Fuck you.